house at the Superdome, getting ready to celebrate its 50th year next season. And this kick will wind up in the zone and enables a run back from Marvin Mims. He'll come to the near sideline and get taken out of bounds up at about the 35-yard line. Played 61 college games, a ton of experience before he got here. And he's going to take off as everybody is covered. And there he goes out to the 50-yard line. He was with Sean Payton here for seven years in New Orleans. So they remember Lutz. They give him a lusty welcome. <laughs> and the kick is good. Really easy read for Rattler. Look out. He gets hit. Was the arm coming forward? Haven't heard a whistle yet. Meanwhile, Cody Barton coming in. But they're going to rule that. Well, they're going to rule that a fumble and a recovery. And then that's when his ball ends up being a perfectly thrown football. Second and six. Through the middle. Big hole. Exploiting it. And tackled from behind up at the 38-yard line goes Javante Williams. And it's first and ten as play resumes from the 50-yard line for Bo Nix. To the outside, he goes, the open man, he finds him. Down the sideline goes Franklin. Halfway through the second quarter. Nope. Wide, so wide much open. <laughs> yeah, Javante Williams for the touchdown. Goes in untouched. So they complete that drive. Williams is the running back. Take it to him. Give it to Camara. Around the corner he goes, but nowhere. As coming up is Jaquan McMillan. This pressure that this offensive line is creating. More pressure again. He fires this one, and again it's dropped. Start on the ground here. And another good run by Williams. <laughs> By the way, Light that's, box. What are you doing? That, that's Manusha 2.0. <laughs> Here's McLaughlin. Look at this, McLaughlin, and they finally stop him at the 25-yard line. So it actually made my wife realize that this was about so much more than just football. It was about being part of the resurrection, one of America's greatest cities. It was a calling. No question about that. There's Kamara making the grab, but tackled there in all of his Broncos gear, <laughs> in his Broncos hoodie. Um, along with a couple of our other coaches. I mean, 75% of their sideline I played with or or had some interaction with over the years. How different it is this year for Bo compared to year three, year four, and year five. Very different. This, look, this, is, this is what the guy gives you here. There he is. He gives you on a third and one. He sets up a first and goal. He looked like Taysom Hill. Yeah. <laughs> with that run. So a Hill first and goal, 75 rushing yards for Knicks tonight. Gives it to Williams, and he burrows his way in for the touchdown. So the Denver Broncos, 69 yards, five plays, four of them on the ground. Second and 28. And down he goes. And finally, they get to him, John Franklin Myers. They completely changed the look. Playing way more zone, not blitzing and relying on that. Here comes a sack here. That time it's Nick Benito. You got a shot. Sure. You get a shot at that wild card. Yeah, nine and eight. Seven teams in each conference going in. And another sack here. So this night of uh, misery in a way will continue. That's a pretty good game <laughs> to play. <laughs> 26 to 3, the Broncos on top. This is payback. Yeah. And a 15 yard game carrying guys with it in the last six quarters. Again, shut out over the last two quarters last week. Taken out of the end zone so far tonight. Just one field goal. Rattler stopped to the 34 yard line. These linebackers, outside linebackers. Second and 10, look out. And is that going to be a fumble, which is taken by Barton in the air? There's no whistle yet. And Barton, what a night this guy's having. Jaquan McMillan is the guy who hits Rattler as the ball is being released. And for the moment, ruled a touchdown.